This is Twit. I want to talk about technology, like the, mm. the relationship to technology in your books. Um, you have a, a line in All the Birds in the Sky, uh, humans build machines like spiders build, spin silk. Yeah. Hey. And I just, that is, I, when I read that, I just can't really stop thinking about it. Let's talk a little bit about your, the role of technology in your books. Yeah, I mean, I love technology, obviously. And, uh, you know, I use technology constantly. I, you know, I used to work with all the folks at Gizmodo. So I kind of got to talk to them about like what they were excited about in the world of technology. And I just, I don't know. I mean, that line in All the Birds in the Sky was kind of part of me trying to, like, that book is specifically about like science versus magic, which kind of translates into you know technology versus nature mm. and i think that you know that's something that i think about a lot in terms of how are we going to be able to continue to be a technological society without destroying our own natural habitat like you know and that's that is i think a dilemma that humans are facing right now and it's something that we don't you know that that we haven't really faced up to as much as we should um we you know we need to get better at building technologies that that don't you know destroy the environment that aren't that are carbon neutral that um, that you know don't pollute and I think that uh, that's something that that we're we're kind of dragging our feet on and so that's a big part of how I think about technology is just like how can we continue to have technology in in a world where the byproducts of our technology are causing a lot of serious issues. And what about just the people who sort of see nature and technology being opposites? Like, oh, get off your screen and go outside. You know, we're like that sort of thing. I know you have sort of a different idea of nature and technology. Talk about that a little bit. I mean, you know, I think nature is a concept that humans invented. And like, it's 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 our word for things that we didn't build. And actually, you know, Anna Lee, my uh, partner who works with with me on all, uh, our opinions are correct you know she she is constantly talking t to me about like these archaeological studies that she's read that basically show that actually humans have been terraforming earth for a lot longer than we realized like the forests are largely you know the rainforest was created by humans i guess and like you know i think that for tens of thousands of years humans have been messing around with this with our own planet and kind of you know cultivating it and planting stuff and moving stuff around and introducing species all over the place. So it's not like there's some untouched state of nature outside of um, the cities that that's just like humans have never messed around with it. We've everything on this planet has been affected by humans since long before we had like engines and, and, you know, since long before we, we started, you know, building machines as we know them today. So, I think that we are part of nature. Humans are part of nature. We're not separate from nature. Technology is not separate from nature. It's, you know, it's just continuing a process that we began a long time ago. Uh, but on the other hand, and I, I think, so part of what I try to get at in All the Birds in the Sky is that that opposition between nature and, and the human world is, is kind of a false distinction. Mm. But at the same time, you know, like, I think somebody actually says this in All the Birds in the Sky, we have a very limited habitat that we can live in. We can't live in conditions past a certain point, like if it gets too hot or if there's not enough water or if the air is, you know, polluted, we can't live anymore. And so we're destroying our own habitat and that's really what it comes down to. Mm. And, you know, yeah, and I like to walk around outside. I don't yeah. know. <laughs> I like to walk around outside with my phone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 